Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Daytime Star episode 55 to 56. Due to Webtoon's new policy, I do have the blur 50% of each episode, so if you guys do want to read along with me, it's available on webtoons.com. And for anyone out there who's interested in my early access, no blur, no filter, no cat logo to hindrance y'all's views of each of my Webtoon's reacts, uh, it is definitely available on patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. I do have different membership tiers. Tiers. You guys can check it out for a free trial for the tier 2 and tier 3 if you guys are interested. But I will drop the link in the description box below. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay. Daytime Star, episode 55. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm trying to remember, like, what happened in the last episode that I have read. Oh, yeah, she invited him up to the apartment to make coffee. Okay, 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 I remember now, I remember now. I don't want to see this, because I giggle. Happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday indeed, love. Thank you. And I love your present. There's more. Uh-huh. To your present. <laughs> I can't. I'm a giggle. <laughs> hello, hello. Uh. Oh, dang. This is so awkward for me. <laughs> I'm gonna be really quiet so you guys can uh, bask in the view. I am not making any sort of sound effects. I'm sorry. You look beautiful. Oh! <laughs> Good lord. I honestly, I don't think I can put this on. <laughs> I'm gonna be end up like blurring this a lot on my public YouTube. My gosh. Okay. Okay. If you guys want to see majority of this uncensored, it was gonna be it's gonna be on my Patreon. I'm sorry. This is very raunchy. Not yet. I haven't even started on my second present yet. Do you want me to stop? No, no, it's not like that. I was just happy. So unbelievably happy. You're nowhere near as happy as I am. No, I'm happy that you are. No, I am. You want to bet? Sure, I'll bet I'll win though. I love you. He said the three words! I know, Diggs. I'm... Uh. Why are you just laughing? Is there anything you want to say back to me? <laughs> hmm, let's see. I want to save it. What? I want to keep the word safe inside me. Oh, inside you, huh? So I can give it to you later. <laughs> Never mind. You better buckle up. You, uh? Because I plan to go on all night. He's gonna be sore. <laughs> okay. This is an awfully long episode. I love you, Sionbe. I love you so much that I wish I could keep it forever inside my heart. Are you up? Oh wait, they're on vacation. I forgot. They're in like Thailand. 
<laughs> Go back to sleep. It's still dawn. What about you? Why aren't you sleeping? You have an early morning shoot. The time flew by as I watched you sleep. Liar. I'm not. Close your eyes and go back to sleep. <laughs> no, I don't want to waste our time together. I can sleep on the plane. Uh... Hey then, do you want to go watch the sunrise? Oh, oh, yes. <sighs> wow, the view is completely different from yesterday. Yeah. Hey, this reminds me of the time we were filming time. It felt horrible thinking the, that our path may never cross again. And now we're here as a couple in real life. I have trouble believing that these moments are, are real. And yet, it makes me want so much more. I want to ask you something. Huh? What? Do you want our relationship to be public? Uh? Mm. To tell you the truth, I was totally against it at first. But now, I don't know. I thought if we did, people would know me as Tian Yun's king's girlfriend rather than actress Yura Huang. I was also worried about the trouble I might cause you. That's why I thought I'll never even think about it until I got my proper footing as an actress. But I guess I'm incredibly greedy. <laughs> I keep wanting more. But I know this isn't a simple matter we can just decide on a whim. And I'm perfectly happy with the things the way things are, so don't worry, okay? I, why won't you say anything? I'm... I'm really okay, yeah? <laughs> Fine, okay. We'll wait a little longer. Until the day when I'll be known as Yura Wong's boyfriend instead. Uh, what? Do you think that day will ever come? Of course I do. And very soon. Because you're an amazing actress. He's so supportive! You guys need to freaking find someone who is supportive like him. Okay? There's a many other Webtoon boyfriends that we read that are very supportive. But, I'm telling y'all, if a guy lacks the support, or the girl lacks support for you and whatever you are dreaming about, and your hobbies, and your work, and, you know, career path and stuff like that, if they doubt you and bring you down and always kill your dream, Dump them, dump them quick, don't hang around, move on, it's okay. Find yourself a loving and supportive person, trust me. And stop giving birth to pathetic losers who are always dragging you down. I'm telling y'all, I'm tired of it. I'm tired of deadbeat fathers. All right, anyways, that's just my rant. <laughs> Yura. Oh my gosh. Jinyoon. It's been a whole day. <laughs> How was your trip? Did you have fun? Yeah, the island was so beautiful. You should totally go there with Mr. Mun sometime. Okay, let's talk about it in the car first. We better get out of here fast. People might recognize the soon-to-be superstar, Yura Huang. <laughs> oh, my sunglasses. There you go again. The news about Jeon Yu Kim is so shocking. Huh? I know, his sweet image was all just a fake. Whoa, it says here, he also leaving elegant table. Well, of course he should. They shouldn't let him get away with what he did. Uh? Jinyun, what are they talking about? Oh, I guess you haven't been on the internet while you were away, huh? Well, I'm not surprised since you had seen Yoon in real life. <laughs> Just tell me what's happening. <clears throat> well, Daytime Star, episode 53. What? Exposed? Yep, someone wrote an anonymous post the day you left for Bangkok. 
Famous actor K's bad work ethics and bullying must be known to the public. I'm writing this post to expose K, who rose to stardom last year for his role in a popular drama and, his, and from his marriage in a powerful family. I have worked with K for many years and those who know me will be able to guess who wrote this post. The public knows K as a kind and hardworking actor, but this is almost a complete opposite of who he really is. Of course, I know that for celebrities, it is part of their job to create an idol idolized version of themselves. But I think the discrepancy between this version and their real life should be within limits of morality. Whereas, K has caused a great harm to those around them. He has a hab habit of sizing up his opponents to determine whether they are weaker than him. Ooh, it was very detailed with the evidence. Oh, plus people who worked with him in the past posted a lot of stuff on social media that lined up with those claims. Who do you think pays you? Get here now, actor Jeon Yu Kim. Okay, yeah, we know who exactly wrote this. Plus, his acting sucks. Jeon Yu Kim's legendary, legendary bad acting. He's such a bad actor, but he kept getting a big roles after his marriage. I bet his in-laws are paying them to hire him. Comment 67. Whoa, the thumbnail says it all. <laughs> I couldn't believe it when they replaced Chang Xiu and Zhou with Jian Yu Kim. Makes, makes zero sense. I would be so ashamed if I were him. How could he be so mean to his own staff? Just because you, he's a celebrity doesn't mean he's royalty. The whole industry is messed up. Maybe he used up all his acting skills pretending to be a decent human being. Lol. Wow, Chels, I was totally fooled. I told everyone he's a my dream man and that I wish I were his wife. We'll never believe a celebrity again. That is what he said to his fans at his fan meeting. Afterward, he threw away the presents and called them no noisy and annoying. Oh, I'm so amazed by the love everyone has shown me. I'm just an ordinary person. If this is real, he is one hell of an actor. Comment, 286 comments. Oh my gosh. I was there that day. I want my money back. Why can't he act like this is his dramas? Just an er ordinary person? Sure. I wonder if his wife knew. I heard he was always out partying even when his fir when they first got married. His father-in-law hated him, but he had no clue because his daughter was too much in love with him. I feel sorry for her. His agency must have realized that he was a lost cause. They admitted to everything before things could get even worse. That's all everyone has been talking about since yesterday. Oh. I can't believe this. I was just gone for a day. I think it was Myon Myonho who wrote the post. What? His manager? Obviously, I don't have proof, but who else would have so much dirt on him with such detail? If he wrote about Jiyeon Yu two timing between you and his wife, that would would have really done it. But seeing as he didn't. I guess his manager has at least a little bit of conscience left in him. <sighs> anyway, now the public hates Jiyeon Yu and his in-laws wants nothing to do with him. Jiyeon Yu is finished. So, Mira, what's all this? What do you think? They're your bags. I want you out of this house. My lawyer will be in touch soon. Wait, Mira, you have to give me another chance, please. You know I love you. Ugh. Ugh. It's fine. Junyu, let's be honest with each other for once. It's not like we're married each other for love. W what are you talking about? Of course I loved... You needed my family's background and money. And I only chose you because unlike the so-called elites, you didn't try to gain the upper hand. You knew your place. Plus, you were such a pretty boy toy I like to show around. If you had gone fired, I could have gotten your job back. Or if you were bad press, I could have stopped them. 
but I can't let you get away with talking back at me. M Mira. That time, I was too drunk to know what I was saying. Oh. Goodbye, Jian Yu. I liked your face, at least. Oh. For people like Jian Yu who like to judge people based on their value, those same kinds of people are the only ones they ha will have left in the end. Then when one side of that relationship becomes less valuable, that's when they get thrown away. What's with a face? Huh? You don't like- you don't look like someone who's watching their sw sworn enemy crumble to pieces. Oh. I don't know, it just feels a, a bit weird. It's not exactly joyful news. I just don't think I- ever wanted to hear his name again for whatever reason. Ugh, you're a stop being such a goody two-shoes. He deserved it. Karma finally caught him up to him. Oh, fine. You be the angel. I'll make sure to gloat for the both of us. <laughs> oh, sweet victory. <laughs> uh, oh, it's killing me. Oh. Oh, I guess this is it. Did you have to make my heart feel heavy till the very end? Why did you have to fall this hard? I didn't want to pity you. But that's exactly what I feel for you right now. Xian Yun Xion Bei, video call. Video call? Bzz, hurry. <laughs> Beep. Oh, Xion Bei. Uh, can you see me? Yes, are you done filming? No, we'll uh, be filming overnight after this break. Did you meet Jin, Jin Yun? Yep, what's with a video call? Oh, I just realized that we've never done it before. Oh, I guess he must have heard about Jin Yu. What about dinner? You must be starving. Oh wait, you must have eaten on the plane. Siyongbe, I'm okay. Uh. Mm. Okay. That's all he said. But that one word filled me with so much comfort. Jian Yun called it karma. I don't know for sure if such thing exists in this world. Because I've seen so many cases where it didn't seem to apply. But still... I would like to believe that our actions will come back to us one day in whatever shape or form. And when that day comes, I hope mine will look beautiful. To be continued. I'm still giggling at sweet victory! <laughs> oh man, you gotta love her. She is hilarious. Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed my webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye! Look at your smile, mama! Look at your smile! <laughs> oh my goodness, you like your scratchy huh? <laughs> Oh my baby! Look at my baby! <laughs> Oh my baba! <laughs> Look! No. Look at my baby! Look! Oh. <laughs> You're so cute! Oh. Okay, I'm done.